we visit the set of a rising young star's debut music video. Music City 411 starts now. What's up, everyone? Welcome to another edition of Music City 411. I'm your host, Shane Talent. We've got a very special episode for you this week. We get an exclusive look behind the scenes of the debut music video for a young, talented musician named Jessica French. You may recognize Jessica from the infamous People of Walmart videos that have been seen by over 10 million people on YouTube. Well, she's releasing her debut album. This is Jessica French. I wanna believe in something more. Right now we're at um, New Mind Studios and I'm filming my first music video called Reality off my new album. The concept is this alien girl in this drowsy little gray planet that gets to meet um, a guy from Earth and kind of is infatuated with this lively human and kind of fall in love, sort of a love story. To be able to go to Kickstarter and, you know, hey fans, I really would like to provide this full length, full production album for you. I know I haven't been able to do that. Um, would you mind helping me? I, I'm a college student and I don't have any money. So um, just to see, I asked for 8,000 and in the end I came up with 28,000. And to see the amount of support was just mind boggling. I still can't comprehend that that many people wanted to just give me money, you know? But this is um, something that I've been waiting a long time put together. It's a full production, full band, maybe a little synth here and there, you know. So everything that I've wanted in an album for the past five years. Of course there's tons of success stories of people moving to Nashville. I was born and raised here so I feel lucky that I haven't had to go that route because I know that it's it's kind of cutthroat and so that's why I took the avenue of doing YouTube and getting to my fans for myself through internet and things like that instead of doing your traditional publishing deal or doing a traditional recording deal because it's just not it's easy to come by. Big hair, dreadlocks, little skirt, red box, hot dog, puppeteer, smiley shirt, slight beer, dog. So I know that people on Music Row were seeing these pictures of people at Walmart so I decided, you know, I think that'd be a great way to get my name, you know, in their email or in their inbox if I wrote a song about it. You know, I want them to know me for my songwriting. So um, it was a great topic to write about. It was funny and it was kind of a joke at first, you know, but it, it took off and it's gotten up to 10 million, which I can't even fathom what like 1 million or 500,000 is, you know. <laughs> my ultimate goal would be to continue sharing. Um, what my fans call real music. I love doing comedy and I want to continue doing comedy and music together. But to be able to, um, you know, give them this full length album that I couldn't produce myself in my house. Um, and going on tour to actually see these people in person and not just via internet and things like that. So I think for them to have like a physical copy of my city in their hands or to come to a show, that's something that I want to give my fans. When somebody save me, when somebody My advice would be to stay persistent and to use all of those avenues. Even if you don't really have a fan base, act like you do. And then, you know, it'll attract a fan base. And, um, yeah, I mean, if you even miss out on one thing, like Twitter. It took me so long to get onto the whole Twitter thing. But once I did, you know, like that opened so many other opportunities. So take advantage of, of Twitter or Facebook or YouTube or Spotify and all those things like that. Like, take every avenue that you can. You can download Jessica's complete debut album on iTunes and Amazon.com. And if you want to see the finished video for the title track, Reality, check it out on her website, jessicamusic.com. Well, that's all the time we have for this week. I'm your host, Shane Talent. Make sure you check us out on our new website, musiccity411.net, and follow us on Twitter. We'll see you next time. Thanks for loving country music.